Hi there, unboxing story from the Beetle Garage. Look, uh, I uh, received the post packet today. It's written to the Hirschkäferverein, to the Stack Beetle Association, and my name's on it. And um, as you can see from the cover, it's kind of a woodworking machine, so that must, be, must come from a uh, timber company or something like this. And I already know what it can be because I I get a phone call from a lady who told me that they received some uh, wood material from Hungary and um, this uh, Hungarian uh, truck with I think that's Euro pallets on it or something like that it came uh, from uh, an Hungarian city so uh, inside of this uh, load of Euro pallets also they found a uh, stack of people um, and so she's uh, writing hello Daniel sorry uh, it took so much of time the freight letter is enclosed so you can see where the beetle is coming from best greetings Andrea and I don't want to give you the details now uh, yeah I don't <laughs> I have to make a research about that paper. So it's uh, it comes from I cannot uh -huh, mark your or sock three thousand six hundred. We have a look on the map later on, but let's first have a look at the stack beetle because we in the stack beetle association we try to care uh, for stack beetle. We want to. I give attention to the especially the larvae of this uh, beetle because the stag beetles themselves they are so well known everybody knows them instantly now whoa here it is look at this beautiful mate. wow this is a real major Hungarian stag beetle look Hornus cervus cervus of course huh? this is uh, the European stag beetle and it's pretty long it's around 8 centimeters and let's take him out here and of course we give him a beetle jelly very quickly so that he can recover from the travel from from this Hungarian town to Switzerland so let's see here he is here so how long he is exactly yeah that's 7.2 or 3 centimeters but it's very well developed as you can see here it has beautiful shape, beautiful shaped mandibles and it's very active so of course we don't want to mix them directly together with our uh, Swiss uh, uh, subspecies of Lucanus Travus Travus and we all also don't want to mix them together with the German ones but that's the way today uh, biodiversity and uh, the genetic pool of the insect is altered and changed by insect that travel with goods of humans. So that's a very normal development along the main roads of transportation of goods uh, that we have now today. So he's crawling away. As I said, he's very active. Uh, already and what we try now of course we give him some food and we will probably choose one of our females that we have and mate him and let's have a look whether they have some signs that we can say this is a little bit a different uh, subspecies than the ones we have here in Europe the beautiful Hungarian Lucanus Cervus Cervus came into Switzerland with a truck transport of Europe pallets from Hungary. Thanks for watching.